Hi there, thank you for the many likes and watching us again on CLD Programming YouTube channel. Today we will create an application with the C-Sharp console, especially for your children to learn how to multiply the tables of 10. We are talking about uh, multiply, but, but there are many options with the program possible. You can multiply, divide, counting up and down. An easy application, special for beginner programmers, so your kids learn the basics of the math and you're learning the basics of the C-Sharp programming. Please don't forget to follow and subscribe us on YouTube, Facebook and Twitter. This for future updates, for more learning to become an expert in C-Sharp programming. So, we will start Visual Studio. A new project, console application, tables, then, okay. So we're in the coding area. Uh, we will create a, run, a random object, object, random new random object. Brackets open close. We will use an integer value one. So the object rated from R and D, R and D. Next, so we get every time a new object, a new value. This from zero to eleven. And the second value, also an integer, integer value 2, also R and D next, from 0 to 11. Why to 11? Machine codes and Visual Studio only codes from 0 to 10, so 0 is not used. Okay, then put a double type for the sum, sum, convert uh, to double, value 1 and value 2, multiply value 2 ok test this so and right line oh wait a moment console right, li right line value one to string because for the output plus plus <coughs> value to to string plus Okay, the next line, the given sum, double given sum, convert also to double,
Okay, so read line. So we will read the line, convert it to double. I put it in the type double given sum. Then we will use uh, if given sum is the same of sum brackets open close uh, we'll give total plus plus First, put here integer total. Okay. Total plus plus. Um, and correct to hold the correct values. Of the user integer correct also zero correct okay then console right line uh, we must have a message for the user. Great. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Uh, put the correct value. Great. Plus. Okay, plus total the total of the total the value okay two string let's close okay Console right line grid perfect and correct and the total okay brackets close okay then else brackets open close Okay, else now total plus plus again total plus plus and then console right line uh, not correct because the given sum is not the sum plus correct to string correct to string yes plus the same plus total to string uh, 
plus to give the answer, the correct answer plus plus the sum to string. Okay, a whole line. Then console out the if statement. Write line environment new line. Uh, we are creating a new line. Okay. Um, because every time the program runs there will no be no loop and so we will create a loop uh, uh, let's put here start and here go to start so every time the program runs it will go to the end and again will go to the begin every time let's play and comp compile it we will see what is the result ok um, Put a value, 20, ok, Why? correct string, yes, given sum, yes, so I'll read line, plus plus ok so right line Change this to right. Okay. Run it again. Ah, uh, that's uh, something else. Okay. Sixty. Six. Now create. Wait, eighteen. Create an error. Zero. Okay, perfect. So she will get four done three correct and here you get the correct answer okay 90 15 10 so you see the loop okay perfect just for the tables of 10 eh? now we will change the program and we will do something else counting up so we we'll change this to plus and the sum also the calculation of the sum from value 1 to value 2 to plus save it compile and run it so now it is plus so 
Grade and error, five, perfect. Change to division. Start and compile it again. Perfect. Great. Arrows. So we counting up the arrows. Perfect. So you can do all the options like you want. Like you see. Thank you for watching, I hope you learned something, goodbye, till next time. Every month we hold a contest. The winner of that month will be shown in one of our lessons. You can win the contest just to su subscribe on us and to like us on YouTube and Facebook. You can win a $25 that you can use, use on Amazon.com. Don't forget it.